so excited today. Today's video is going to be on my conversion story to Islam. I know a lot of you guys have asked me to make this video and I've been wanting to do it for such a long time. I finally got the chance to just sit down and record. I'd like to start by saying that I come from a non-religious family. Um, my parents do believe in God, but they don't believe in religion. And there is reasons for that. My grandparents uh, went through communism. My parents were born and grew up during uh, communism. My country was uh, one of the most isolated at the time, and religion was was banned by constitution. Basically, people um, have moved away from religion. Um, it doesn't mean that people are not spiritual, so that, that was the case in, in my family. I grew up without any religious education whatsoever. We don't have religious uh, lessons um, in schools. So basically, I, no, no one ever spoke to me about God, and what's going to happen to me when I die, or anything like that. However, I was very spiritual ever since I was a little girl. Um, I used to... there and my parents never um, stopped me from doing that because they raised me um, to be independent and to make decisions for myself so basically my father would show me what is wrong and what's right and then let me make a decision um, so I kept going to church I used to go two to three times that I always wanted for myself. At the same time, I was going through a lot of struggles. I was just thinking about the, the, the people that surrounded me and life in the States, which was very individualistic to me. I see people working all the time and they're running to work. They're just like doing things, doing things, doing things.
I'm like, why are these women doing these things? Like, is this how Muslim women actually are? So I just go home and uh, I wanted, that's like the first part, I wanted to know what Islam is all about, what these women are all about, because I hear in the media that they're very conservative and then I went home and I researched it and I was like, this is so much hypocrisy that I couldn't even swallow it. that I was really troubled with in the religion I was following Christianity even though I really believed in God and I believed in Jesus was the fact that uh, Christianity did not like was very incompatible with science because I did believe in science and for me to be convinced about something that uh, it is the truth it needs to make logical sense